Acanthosis nigricans brown to black hyperpigmentation of skin. This part of skin is poorly defined and has velvety-like appearance. Acanthosis nigricans usually found in the body folds, such as neck, armpits, groin, navel, forehead and possible in almost any areas. Acanthosis nigricans indicates hormonal dysfunction. Especially hyperinsulinemia and insulin resistance. Insulin activates insulin-like growth factor receptors, which leads to proliferation of keratinocytes, fibroblasts, and other cells on the skin. Acanthosis nigricans usually develops in early ages, before age of 40 and can be associated with other hormonal disorders like hypothyroidism, polycystic ovary syndrome, Cushing disease, stomach cancer paraneoplastic syndrome. Malignant acanthosis nigricans is very rare but commonly associated with gastrointestinal adenocarcinomas, as well as genitourinary cancers such as those of the prostate, breast, and ovary. The most common cause is insulin resistance and hyperinsulinemia. Diagnosis is made by clinical picture. Acanthosis nigricans can be two types. Malignant and benign. Benign this may include obesity-related, hereditary, and endocrine forms of acanthosis nigricans. Malignant. This may include forms that are associated with tumor products and insulin-like activity, or tumor necrosis factor. Management. People with acanthosis nigricans should be screened for diabetes and, although rare, cancer. Controlling blood glucose levels through exercise and diet often improves symptoms. Topical fade creams, normally used for eliminating age spots, can lighten skin cosmetically in less severe cases. Selenium sulfide topical 2% also effective, applied in thin layer to dry skin 10 minutes prior to bathing. Malignant acanthosis nigricans may resolve if the causative tumor is successfully removed. Prognosis. Acanthosis nigricans is likely to improve in circumstances where a known cause is removed. For example, obesity-related acanthosis nigricans will improve with weight loss, and drug-induced acanthosis nigricans is likely to resolve when the drug is ceased.